Alrighty, here we go. Hey there, everybody. It's the Nasty One here again, and welcome back to the next episode of the Freebooters franchise here in year number 10. Last episode, we took on the Moose in a big double header for the division, and we beat the piss out of them 10 to 3, and then 22 to 1 as we embarrassed them rather badly. <laughs> Going off those two big wins, we are now tied with the Herbosaurus for first place in the division, and we will be squaring off with them here in game number eight. On the mound for us is going to be Malaya Ellison, making her second start of the year, and on the other side, it is going to be long reliever Felix Farmhand making his second start, 0-1 with a 1688 ERA and a 263 whip. Ellison is 1-0 with a 117 ERA and a 104 whip as we end this three-game road series. All right, here's the lineup for today's game. Leading off will be Dash Correa, who's on fire in right field. First baseman Harsh McFreddy is batting second. Center fielder Nico Jennings, the captain, bats third. He's locked in. Aliyah Orr, the shortstop rookie, is locked in as well, batting fourth. Efra Ho, the catcher, will bat fifth. Rookie Gideon Turnbull is batting sixth. He is also locked in. Batting seventh is the DH today, Kenzie Rodriguez, who's still a little hurt. Batting 8th, 2nd baseman Elliot Straining getting the start over the Fishman, Cole Salmon. And batting ninth, at 3rd base, Colton Burnett, who is also tense. Let's get it on. Alright, so this will conclude the first half of the regular season, leaving us only 8 games left in this uh, series for the regular season. Not counting playoffs, of course. Herbiser is looking like a pretty well-rounded team. Got good bullpen, good defense, uh, good average, yeah, good speed, good power. Got average pitching and starting pitching in contact, so not a bad team. Here we go, Correa, McFreddy, and Jennings up first against Farmhand. Correa leading off is on fire in right field, hitting 444 with two homers and nine RBIs. Let's quick look at Felix's numbers on the air. Farmhand on the year is 0-1. He is a 1688 ERA and a 263 whip. He's given up five earned runs and two and two-thirds innings in his first start. He took the loss. Five hits surrendered, one home run ball, and two walks. His batting average against is 385, and he struck out four batters. Let's see how he does. Start his day. Fastball in there at the letter is 0-1. Sliders inside, ball one. Check swing inside, good take by Correa, 2-1. Fastball down and in. Correa drives it left center field. Hits it pretty well. Running it down in the gap though. Oh, and they missed it. Left fielder missed it. They whiffed on the catch. Correa will lead off with a double. That should have been caught. Next up is first baseman Harsh McFreddy hitting 444 with seven RBIs. No error on the play as it did not touch the fielder's glove. It will be a hit. Fastball up and in. Misses. Ball one. Fastball up and way outside. 2-0 to Harsh. Fastball up, line through the middle. Diving second baseman is off his glove into center. Infant single for McFreddy as runners will be at the corners with none down for the captain today, Nico Jennings. Center fielder in the three slot, locked in, hitting 471 with seven RPIs on the air. Slider low, ball one. Arm hand already in a jam as that slider caught the inside corner, one and one. Fastball up, driven deep by Jennings. He crushed that one. Cannonball coming at you, dead center field off the batter's eye. Right off the base there at the uh, SeaWorld Training Center. Uh, Three-run shot for Nico Jennings, his first home run of the season, and that makes it a 3-0 game. Big bomb for the captain as that'll bring up shortstop rookie Alia Orr, who's locked in in the four slot, hitting 588 with the homer and 13 RBIs. His farmhand is already tense, three batters into the game. Change up down the middle, fouled off, 0 and 1. Fastball down in the way is a strike, going 2. Slider at the knees, fouled off, 0 and 2. Slider outside, dribbler to second. Stewart there to make the stop, 1 down. That's going to bring up Everett Ho, the catcher, batting in the 5 slot, hitting 333 with 2 RBIs. It has his outside pitch trade active. Fastball down in the way, line to second, right at Stewart though as he reaches up, two down. That'll bring up rookie left fielder Gideon Turnbull, locked in hitting 563 with nine RBIs on the year. Pass bumping in is a strike, going one. Pass bumping away, dribbler to third, easy play for Yamamoto, and that ends the inning. Freebitters though get three runs on the home run by Jennings, bottom one, we're up three. King, Stewart, and you do up first here against Ellison. 
Leading off is DH today, Kelby King. Power of his right hander active, hitting a buck 43. One RBI in the season. Here's a look at Ellison's numbers from her first start. Ellison gave up one run in that outing, which she took the win. Uh, 117 ERA and a 104 whip. She pitched seven and two thirds innings, giving up seven hits, one of them a homer, one walk, and five strikeouts. Her batting average against 241. Lineup for the Herbisaurus looks like this. After King, it is the second baseman today, Milo Stewart, who is locked in. Then it is left fielder Robin Yu. Batting fourth is first baseman Captain Grunt Manley, who is tense. Batting fifth is the third baseman Yo Yo Yamamoto. Batting sixth, center fielder Man and Moon, who is locked in. Batting seventh, right fielder Chesley McDowell. Batting eighth, catcher Sting McGee, who they just recently signed in free agency. And batting ninth is shortstop Mario Mustachio. He is tense. Let's get it on. Let's put slider up and away to King as it called strike the letters 0 1. Pass for down and in. King drives that one. Right center field. Hits it pretty hard. Jenny's going back to the warning track. Makes the catch. One down. Good hustle there. That'll bring up second baseman Milo Stewart, who is locked in. Inside pitch active for him as he's hitting 429 with one homer and five RBIs on the air. Pass bumping away is outside. Ball one. Curve ball middle of the way. Dribble to short. Four charges. Fires the first. Two down. Next up will be left fielder Robin Yu. Contact for his right hander active. Hitting 304 with one homer and three RB guys. Batting in the three slot today for the Herbisaurs. First pitch change up down. Taking low. Good eye. Ball one. Slider down at the knees. Check swing strike. One on one. Pass ball up and away. Caught a strike. One and two. Pitcher's count here for Ellison. Trouble down and in. In the dirt. Two and two. Pass ball up and in. Foul back. Still two and two. Change it down and away. Outside in the dirt. Full count now. Composed activates for Ellison. Slider away. Fouled off. Still a full count as you is working it here. Fastball down and in. Swung through it, strike three. First punch out for Ellison today. That is a 1 2 3 inning. To the second. We're up 3 0. Rodriguez straining and Burnett bottom three in the lineup. Do up against Farmhand. Looking to bounce back from the first inning where he gave up three hits, one of them a big three run homer. DH Kenzie Rodriguez leading off, hitting 6 15 with four homers and 11 RBIs as she has her power versus right hander trade active. Pass bumping away is high. Ball one. Way out in front of the changeup inside. One on one. Changeup away. Lined up the third baseline. Yamamoto makes the catch though on the soft liner. One down. That'll bring up second baseman Elliot Straining getting the start today over the fish man Cole Salmon. Hitless on the ear. Slider low. Ball one. Slider middle of the plate. He pops it up. The Straining misses that one. Coming in as the center fielder Man and Moon. He will make the catch for the second out. Next up's going to be third baseman Colton Burnett, who's batting in the nine slot today. Still tense, hitting 345, but three RBIs on the year. Change up down and away is low. Ball one is that's a good take from Burnett. Heater is high to him, 2 0. Fastball middle of the zone is skied to center field. Moon back a few steps, now coming in. Makes the catch, and that's a 1 2 3 inning for Farmhand to the second, bottom half. Manly, Yamamoto, and Moon, 4 5 and 6 do up. Leading off is the captain for the Herb's Horse, first baseman Grunt Manley, who is tense, hitting only a buck 18 on the season. Not a great start to his 10th season here in the league. Change of down and in, check swing strike, 0 and 1. Basketball down in the way is a strike, 0 and 2. Tough out now active for Manley. Slider up and in, line to first, McFreddy there to make the catch, 1 down. Next up, Yamamoto to third baseman, hitting 208, four RBIs on the year. Fastball up and in is a strike, going one. Change up and away, check swing strike, going two. Throw ball down and in, in the dirt, low, ball one. Slider down in the way, dribbler to first, ready charges, bare hands, taps the bag himself, two down. And that will bring up center fielder Man and Moon, who's locked in, hitting 176 now with one homer, two RBIs. 
not hitting particularly well in the air, but as of recently, he's been hitting pretty decently. Fast bump and away is a strike. Oh, oh that's outside ball one. Curveball middle in. Sky ball foul. Out of play. 1-1. One, one. Slider down in the way. Is this checks called a strike at the knees? 1-2. Change bump it in. Inside. 2-2. Two two. Good take from Moon. Fast bump and away. Popped up. Shallow left center field. Turnbull in. Makes the catch, and that's a 1 2 3 inning for Ellison. She's got six up and six down here to start her day. To the third, Correa, McFreddy, and Jennings go up against Farmhand. Here's Correa, the right fielder, doubled his first time up and then scored on the home run by Jennings. Change it down, and then it's low for a strike, going one. Fastball inside breaks as bad as it's dribbled the second. Stewart makes the play one down. As Farmham back to neutral mojo as that brings up McFreddy. One for one today with a single. Change up in there for a strike. 0 and 1. Slider outside misses. 1 and 1. Fastball up. Swung late. 1 and 2. Slider at the knees. Driven to center field on the line, but it's right to Moon. 2 down. Picks up the captain, Nico Jennings, at home at his first time up, driving in the only three runs on the game scoreboard. One for one today. Slider low, ball one. Fastball away is a strike on the check swing, one and one. Fastball at the knees, Jennings turns on it, lines it in the right field, hits it hard, and right off the top of the wall, that's going to be extra bases. Throwing is late. Two out double keeps the inning alive here for the free bidders as that brings up the rookie or RBI man active as she lined out her first time up. 0 for 1. Fastball low, ball 1. Slider outside, line to right center field. That will get down in front of McDowell as he was shaded a little bit more towards the line. RBI single for or as that makes it a 4 0 game. And farmhand is tense once more as we bring up Effort Ho, the catcher, 0 for 1 today. Change it down and in is fouled off. 0 and 1. Fastball up and in. Lined off the pitcher's glove to second base. Stewart recovers in time to get Ho and that ends the inning. RBI single for Orr though gives us a 4 nothing lead now as we got another insurance run. Bottom three. McDowell, McGee, and Mustachio do up. Hitting off the inning is right fielder Chesley McDowell, the rookie, hitting 316 with a homer and one RBI. First pitch fastball up. Fouled off. 0 and 1. Slider down, taken low, 1-1. One one. Change up up, foul off, 1-2. and two. Throw ball down and away. Called strike three at the knees. Second punch out for Ellison today. One down, and that'll bring up catcher Sting McGee, who has just signed off the free agent market before this game, making his debut for his 10th season. Getting his first at bat as well. Fastball high, ball one. Change up away. Line to left field. That is going to be a base hit as McGee has his first hit of the season. One for one. That's the first hit for the Herbosaurus today. Ellison no longer locked in as she's down to neutral. That'll bring up shortstop Mario Mustachio hitting buck 88 with one homer and three RBIs as he's currently tense. Warmer Buzzard stand out not having a good start to his years. That's a strike at the knees. 0-1. Mustachio also entering his 10th year in the league. Slider down and the way is low. 1-1. Change up and in. Swung through it early. One and two. Pass ball up and away. Outside. Two and two. Throw ball down and in. Grounded up the middle of the second. Straining backhands. Flips the second one or to first. Double play and the base runners are raced as that ends the inning. Harvesters get their first hit on a single by McGee, but it is very quickly erased on a double play ball. To the fourth. Turnbull, Rodriguez, and Straining do up. Leading off rookie left fielder Gideon Turnbull. 0 for 1 today with a ground out. Change-ups inside to start the at-bat. Ball 1 as farm hands back to neutral mojo. Change-up down and in. Caught the zone this time. 1 and 1. Fastball down the middle. Line to left center field. That is down for a base hit. Cut off by Yu. And Turnbull has a single. Lead off man on for the free bidders. That will bring up Rodriguez, the DH. 0 for 1 today. 
Flew out her first time up. Fastball up, swung late, 0 1. Arm hand now tense once more as that slider's outside, 1 1. Fastball middle in, line to short. Mustachio makes the catch, 1 down. Arm hand back to neutral, and that'll bring up straining. 0 for 1 with the pop out his first time up. Fastball dribbled in the dirt to third. Yamamoto the second one. Stewart the first. Double play, and that ends the inning of straining is now tense. Bottom four, it's 4 0. King, Stewart, and you do up against Ellison. Kelby King is over one today. Flew out her first time up to the deepest part of the park in right center field. Fastball down in the way is a strike, going one. Ball down and in. Foul off, 0 2. Slider up and away. Dribbler to first. McFreddy there. Taps the bag himself. One down. Mm -hmm. Pardon me. Next up is second baseman Milo Stewart. He's up for one today. First pitch change up, up and away. Check. Call to strike the letters. 0 1. Fastball up and away. High. 1 1. Slider down and away. Foul off. 1 and 2. Throw ball up and away. Sky ball to right field. Correa right there. Makes the catch. Two down. Got to bring up Robin Yu, the left fielder. Struck out swinging his first time up. He's over one. Pass ball down and away. Outside. Ball one. Change at middle in. Foul off by Yu. One on one. Throw ball down and in. Foul off again. One and two. Pass ball up and away. Sky ball to right field as he got under it. Correa back a few steps to his left. Makes the catch, and that's a 1-2-3 inning for Ellison. To the fifth. It's still 4 to nothing. Freebooters, Burnett, Correa, and McFreddy do up. Here's Burnett. 0 for 1 today with the ground out. Or fly out. Pass ball in there at the letters. 0-1. Slider middle in. Lined up the middle, and that's a base hit for Burnett as he gets it through the middle of the infield. He's one for two today, so he's on the lead off the inning, and that'll bring up Dash Korea, the right fielder. One for two today with the double. Burnett takes off on the first pitch, sliders inside. Throw down by McGee is late. That is a stolen base for Burnett. For Colton, that is his uh, second attempt to steal this year. He is now one for two. One of the count to Correa. Slider down, and then is inside. Two and oh. Pass ball up and in. Correa skies at the left center field. That's going to hang up, though, for you to make the catch one down. I bring it McFreddy. One for two today with a single. Pass ball up and he's lined to center field, but it's right to Moon as he hardly moves. Two down. Bit of bad luck there on that hard liner. Next up, Jennings, who doubled off the wall last time up and then scored a run on a single. He's also hit a three-run homer today. He's two for two. Looking driving his fourth run of the game. Fastball up and in is a strike, going one. Fastball up and in is high, one and one. Fastball up, line in the hole to short, into left field on the dive, that's a base hit. Just got by the Mustachio's glove, runners will be at the corners here with two down. Jennings now a triple shot for the Cycles, that brings up Orr, rookie single in a run last time up, she's one for two, and she is also lined out to third base. RBI man active once more for the rookie. Pass up and in breaks its bat as it's dribbled to third. Yamamoto cuts it off at shortstop and fired a first to end the inning. Zor strands runners at the corners. Bottom five. Manly, Yamamoto, and Moon do up against Ellison. Not too often Orr fails to come through with a runners in scoring position. Here's Manly, 0 for 1 today. Captain look turn things around for his club as he takes a strike in there at the knees on the heater, 0 and 1. Slider middle away. Chased it outside, 0 and 2. Tough out active for Manley again. Change it down in the way. In the dirt, ball one. Throw ball down and in. Line to second. Straining there makes the catch at his shoe tops. One down. Next up, Yamamoto. 0 for 1 today. Pass ball up and away. Foul back. 0 and 1. Throw ball down and away. Foul off. 0 and 2. Change up an inch. Fouled off again. Still 0-2. 
slider down and in. Hit and hold a second. Straining dives and cuts it off. Nice stop for the second year player. Two down. That's going to bring a man and moon who's 0 for 1 today and still locked in. Let's change it down in the way. Call it a strike of the knees. 0 and 1. Slider down and in. Call it a strike. 0 and 2. Fast bump and away. Chase it outside. Strike 3. Third punch up for Ellison today. Another 1 2 3 inning for her. To the 6. We're still up 4 0. Ho, Turnbull, and Rodriguez do up. We're cruising along here into the 6. Effort Ho leading off. Grounded out his last time up. He's over 2. Farmhand stays out there to start the 6th inning. Change bet the knees. Lined right at the shortstop. Mustachio, 1 down. Oh, now 0 for 3 as that brings up Turnbull, who singled last time up. He's 1 for 2, and he's also flown out. Change up in the dirt. Ball 1. Nope. Nice popping away. 2 and 0. Slider away. 3 and 0 as Farmhand loses his own all of a sudden. Fastball in the dirt. Ball four. It's four-pitch walk. First walk today for Farmhand as Turnbull's on with one down. Next up, Rodriguez is 0 for 2. That would do it for Felix as he goes five and a third innings, giving up uh, four earned runs on eight hits with one walk in line for the loss. Coming out of the bullpen is left-hander Atlanta Lantana, who has just recently signed off the free agent market, making her season debut. Former Wild Pig Southpaw is now on the Herbisaurus roster here in her 10th year. First pitch fastball up and in is inside. Ball one. Fastball down and in is popped up. Shallow right field. In on it is the right fielder. And making the catch is McDowell. Two down. Lantana looking to strand the runner first as we bring up Straining. Oh, for two days. He grounded into a double play last time up. He's also popped out. Currently tense. Keep the inning alive with the hit. Cutter away. Caught the zone away. Low. 0 and 1. Fastball up line to center field. And that is a base hit for Straining. His first hit of the season as he is now 1 for 3 today. Back to neutral mojo as well as that brings up Burnett. Singled his last time up and then stole a base but was stranded in third. Fastball at the knees away. First strike going one. Fastball middle in line at the middle. Diving with Stewart to cut it off to his right. Fires the first in time and that ends the inning. As Burnett fails to come through. Bottom six. It's four nothing. McDowell, McGee, and Mustachio do up against Ellison. Here's McDowell. Oh, for one of the days he struck out swinging his first time up. Ball down in the way. Called a strike. Going one. Fastball up and away. Lined in the left center field. Hit hard in the gap. Turnbull over to make the catch at his shoe tops. One down. Got to bring up McGee. One for one today with a single. So far the only hit today for the Herbosaurs. And then he was erased on a double play ball. First pitch slider away. Lined in the center field as it hung. Right to Jennings though for the second out. Brings in Mustachio. over for one with the grounded into a double play his first time up. 4-6-3, double play, I believe. First pitch fastball down and in. There's a strike, going one. Change it down and away. Dribbled up the middle. Four dives, she can't get there, and that is a seeing eye single for Mustachio. His first hit today, he's one for two. His second hit today for the Sir Herbisaurs overall. So that extends the inning for the leadoff hitter, Kelby King. DH is over two today. Pick off the first, nothing doing. Fastball down in the way is low. Ball one. Slider in there. Lined up the middle. Past the diving straining into right center field. That's going to get all the way to the wall as Jennings gives chase and gets it in quickly to the cutoff man as the runner comes around third. Throw from McFreddy is late. It is an RBI double for King as they are on the board here. It's four to one. Next up is Stewart who's 0 for 2. No longer locked in unfortunately for him and neither is Ellison. First pitch curve all away. Outside, ball one. Fastball down in the way, swung over it, one and one the count. Slider middle away, fouled off, one and one, two the count. Change it down in the way. Hard grounder to first, McFreddy backhands it, runs to the bag and beats Stewart, and that ends the inning. Herbisers though get on the board with the two out double from Kelby King as it's 4 1 to the seventh. Correa, McFreddy, and Jennings do up against Lantana. Here's Correa, one for three today with the double. Fastball down the middle, 0-1. Slider 
slider middle end, lined in the left field for Correa, his first second hit today. He is two for four as that got over the diving Mustachio. I'll bring up McFreddy, one for three today with a single. Fastball up and in is a strike, going one. Slider up and in is popped up, shallow right center field. That is a tough play, but McDowell able to run in to make the catch one down. That's going to bring up Jennings, three for three today. He is triple shy of the cycle as he singled his last at bat. He's driven in all three, three of our four runs. Steeler active for Cray at first. Pick off to first, nothing doing. Runner goes. Fastball up for a strike. Throw down in the dirt is late anyway as Correa steals second. Dash's uh, fourth attempt to steal this year. He is perfect four for four. Oh, one the count to Jennings. Fastball's away, misses one and one. Slider middle of the way, line to short. Right to Mustachio, two is right, two down. Next up is Orr, one for three today with an RBI single. Grinding that her last time up. Pitch out, nothing doing as they want. They are going to walk or to not deal with her in the runner position. Um, with the runner in scoring position. Don't blame them. There's the second wide one. Third wide one. Walk prone active for Lantana. And there's the fourth one as well. Intentional walk here for Orr. Brings up the catcher effort hose over three and tenths. We're going to pinch hit for him. We off the bench is backup catcher Parker Freeman as he'll take the at bat. Freeman uh, hitting two for th uh, either four for six on the year, one RBI in the season. First and second here with two down. Fastball at the knees for a strike from Lantana, 0 and 1. Fastball up, line to right, off the diving Manley's glove into shallow right field. That'll be a base hit. Correa will score easily from second as Orr gets the third on the RBI single by Freeman and is 5 to 1. That'll bring up Turnbull, rookie one for two with a single. Walked his last time at the plate. Still locked in. Fastball nope, up on the check swing. High, ball one. Slider middle of the plate, hard ground at the middle. Diving to Stewart to make the stop. Fires to first in time, and that ends the inning. Good defensive play to save a run. Still a single by Freeman on the pinch hit roll. 5 1 the score for the free bidders. Bottom seven. Hard to line up, up for the Herbisaurs, though. You, Manley, and Yamamoto. Here's you. Robin is 0 for 2 today. Freeman staying in the game behind the dish at catcher as he subbed in for Ho last at that. Slotted down and in on the first pitch. Sky to right center field. Jennings going over in the gap. A call off Correa. Make the catch one down. Next up is Grunt Manley. Captain 0 for 2 today. Currently 10s. Fastball down and in is low. Ball one. Ball down and away. Outside and low. 2 0. Fastball up and in is high. 3 0. Composed activates here. Slide it down and in. Low ball four. First walk today for Ellison as she's no longer locked in. Puts Manley on at first with one down for Yamamoto. Who's over two? Change it down and in the first pitch. Fools Yamamoto as he's looking fastball. 0 and 1. Slide it down and away. He's in the dirt. 1 and 1. Fastball up. Taken high. 2 and 1. Go down the way, swung through it outside, two and two the count. Change it down and in. Grounded to first. McFreddy actually picked that off at his shoe tops for the second out on the liner, but he misses the tag on Manley, who dove under his swinging backhanded attempt. I think a man and moon is up for two today as he looks to extend the inning. Fastball down and in, grounded up the middle. Straining dives, he can't get there, that's a base hit. First and second now with two down as the Herbisaurs extend the inning. Now to bring up Miff McDowell, rookie 0 for 2 today, looking to drive in a run. First pitch curveball middle in, grounded up the middle of the second, straining backhands, it fires the first in time, and that ends the inning. As Ellison strands two runners to the eighth, it is 5 to 1 still. Rodriguez straining and Burnett do up against Lantana. Here's Rodriguez, over three days so far for the DH as she looks to turn her luck around. Fastball down and then is a strike, going one. 
Asp up, foul off, 0 and 2 the count. Asp up and in, hard ground to the second. Stewart backhands it to his right. Easy play for him, one down. A ring of straining, one for three today. Got his first single and first hit of the year last at bat. Hitting one for nine in the year now. Last ball and in, one hopper to second. Stewart makes the play, two down. Now to bring up Colton Burnett, third baseman, one for three today with the single. Grounded out last time up, so he takes a slider in the dirt, ball one. Slider middle in, lined at the middle on the ground. Stewart dives again to his right to make the stop and robbed Burnett of another hit. One, two, three inning for the Herbisaurs, bottom eight. McGee, Mustachio, and King do up against Ellison. Here's Sting McGee, catcher one for two today with a single. First pitch curveball down and in is inside, ball one. Slider at the knees, lined hard to third. Burnett dives to his right to make the catch, nice stop, one down. Next up, Mustachio, one for two, single this last time up. Last ball up and in, is fouled off, 0-1. Change of down and in, low, 1-1. Slider up and away, caught a strike, 1-2. and two. Curveball down and away, chasing in the dirt, strike 3. Freeman picks it up and fires to first, that is the fourth punch out today for Ellison. Two down and that'll bring up King, 1-3 for three with a double and an RBI today. Doubled in that run last time up. She takes a fastball down and in. Ball one. Ellison locked in once more. As that curveball's down and away and sky to right center field. Jennings over for it. Makes the catches in the gap. And that's a 1-2-3 inning for Ellison as she gets through the eighth. And a ninth that is 5-1. Correa, McFreddy, and Jennings do up. He's looked to add on some insurance. Here's Correa. Two for four days. Singled his last time up. He's also doubled and stolen the base. Currently on fire. Fastball down the middle for a strike, going one. Fastball down the middle again, Correa didn't miss it this time as he crushes it to center field. He got all of that one, folks. Cannibal coming at you as it's in the Herbisaurs bullpen. Solo home run for Dash, his uh, third home run of the year? Yep, and that insurance run makes it 6-1 free bidders. Next up is McFreddy, one for four with a single today. Slider inside, misses, ball one. Pass down the way, grounded up the middle. Stewart dives behind the bag to make the stop. Fires to first. In time, one down. Nice play again by Milo. Next up is Jennings, who uh, was retired last time up. He is still a triple shy of the cycle with three RBIs today. He's three for four. Cutter at the knees for a strike, going one. Pass down and then dribbled to second. Stewart bare hands it, flips, two down. Got to bring up Orr, rookie one for three today. Was intentionally walked last time up. She's also singled in a run. Fastball high, ball one from Lantana. Fastball at the knees, grounded hard to third, diving Yamamoto to make the stop. Fires to first in time, and that ends the inning. Nice defensive play there, but uh, Freebooters get a leadoff homer from Dash Correa as he extends the lead to five. It is 6-1. Bottom nine, Stewart, Yu, and Manley do up. Ellison done here after eight innings, giving up four hits, one walk, four strikeouts, and one earned run on a double. She's in line for the win as she has a quality start. Stewart out for three today as he's leading off the inning. Coming out of the bullpen is going to be long reliever Violet Combs in her second year. Combs on the air has made two appearances this season. No record, no ERA, and an 0 whip. No runs given up in four innings pitched. Two hits surrendered with four strikeouts recorded. Batting average against 154 on the year. First pitch slider middle away is outside to Stewart. Ball one. Fastball up and away is a strike. One and one. Purple down and away at the knees. Line hard to third. Burnett dives past under his glove into the corner. Turnbow gets it in easily to hold Stewart to a single. He's one for four. Next up is Robin Yu, who's 0 for 3 today. Big off first, nothing doing. Fastball down and then is in, it's caught a strike at the knees, 0 and 1. Change it down and in. 
Low, one-on-one. -on -one. We got first, nothing doing. Curve ball up and in. Sky ball by you to left field. Turnbull in. Falls for it and makes the catch one down. Next up is going to be Grunt Manley of two today with the walk. Earned that walk last time up at the plate. Change it down. A lot of strike to the knees, 0-1. Fastball up and in is a strike, 0-2. Oh Tough bad active for Manley here. Slide it down in the way, in the dirt, 1-2. and two. Good eye there. Curve ball up and away. Sky ball into right field on the soft liner. That is a base hit. Second hit from, first hit for Manley today. He's 1-3 for three as that extends the inning here with one down for Yamamoto. Two on now, four. First pitch curveball down in the way is a strike with the knees, 0-1. Oh Basketball down and in. Dribbler to the left of the mound. Gets by the pitcher is straining. Bare hands it and misses it. And that is going to be an error on straining as Yamamoto reaches. Base is loaded now for Moon. One for three today with a single. As pinch hitting for him is right fielder Javi Yotter. Back up to McDowell. RBI dot an outside pitch active for him. He's hitting 292 on the year with one homer and six RBIs here in his 10th season. Yotter, the former nemesis product, has been with the Herbisource for the past four years. Slider down and in. Call to strike the knees, 0-1. Fastball up and in. Line to first. Right at McFreddy who makes the catch two down as the bases remain juiced. That ran McDowell, rookie 0 for 3 today as he looks to come through in the clutch for his team. First pitch change it down in the way is a strike, 0-1. Slider down and in is low, 1-1. Fastball middle away, skied into left center field, Turnbull back to the warning track. Makes the catch and that ends the inning as Combs manages to get out of the bases loaded jam in the ninth without allowing a run to score. Her freebooters win easily today 6-1 to one, as they take the division lead from the Herbisaurs by a full game. Advancing to 6-2 on the year as the Herbisaurs will fall to 5-3. Solid offensive day as we eke out six runs, got the big blast there in the first inning and we never look back. Batting lines today. Everybody in our lineup got a hit today except Effort Ho and Kenzie Rodriguez. Uh, pinch hitter Parker Freeman chipped in an RBI single. Uh, three round homer for Nico Jennings in the first inning. Aliyah Orr, an RBI single. And Dash Correa, a solo home run in the ninth. Or in the eighth. Was it the eighth? It was either the eighth or ninth. I think it was the ninth. On the other side for the Herbisaurs, hitless today were Robin Yu, Yamamoto, the pinch hitter Javi Yotter, and rookie Chesley McDowell. Everyone else got a one hit exactly. Only RBI today goes to Kelby King, who doubled in the run back in the sixth inning. Uh, Malaya Allison gets a, goes eight innings, giving up four hits, one walk, one earned run on four strikeouts. When gets her second win of the year, she has her second quality start. Uh, Violent Combs goes an inning out of the pen, giving up two hits, but manages to get out of a bases loaded jam unscathed. On the other side, lost today goes to Felix Farmhand, a 10th year vet, 5 and a 3rd innings, 8 hits, 4 and runs a walk and a home run ball. He falls to 0 and 2. Atlanta Lantana, 3 and 2 thirds innings, 4 hits, 2 and runs, 1 walk, 1 homer given up in her season debut. Player of the game is Nico Jennings, who was triple shy of the cycle, driving in 3 runs on the big home run in the first inning, scoring twice. Dash Correa, the runner up, was also a triple shy of the cycle as he had that solo home run late. Three runs scored in a stolen base, and then Malia Ellison, eight innings pitched, quality start, four hits, earned run a walk, and four strikeouts. <coughs> Not a bad game at all. All right, let's keep it up. So at the end of the first half of the regular season, in our final uh, year here in the franchise, we are six and two, on pace to make the playoffs once again for the seventh straight year. Let's see if we can keep that momentum going in the second half of the year as we look at uh, player developments. Nettle Fiducci gets plus five contact. Nice. That's solid right there. Malaya Ellison loses two junk. She drops down to a B from a B plus. Not ideal. Correa loses two speed. Also not ideal. Sirline signed 10th year vet Mantonio Levo as he replaces Olaf Beerson on their bench. Already played the Sirlins this year. I believe we lost that game rather badly. All right, look at player developments here. 
Uh, let's see, not seeing anything that I overly love. Uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to save up because uh, most of them I can't afford. And the others uh, I just don't like. So we're not going to worry about any of these. Maybe Ellison's, that seems like the best one, but we won't get it for any time soon. Alright, and I think I am going to make a roster move here. I think it's time to let Elliot's training go. I mean, I like Elliot, but he's just not hitting when he gets his opportunities, even with that extra contact boost he has going for him. He's just not having a good day. So at second base, there is a suitable bench replacement by Dion Base. Uh, unfortunately for Dion, he is currently a really expensive, so I don't think he is signable at the moment. The other option is utility player Maggie Rags, who does not hit. She is defense, purely defense, and pinch runner material. That's it. Do not give her a bat. You give her a bat, bad things will happen. The other suitable replacement would be Ian Fielder, the 10th year vet as well, who has a utility infielder. He would make a nice suitable replacement. Other than that, I'm not seeing too much here. I mean, there's Hanzo Majiko, but he's just no. All around bad. Yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all we're really interested in. So I will be releasing Elliot Straining at some point here in the season, but right now, the person I want to sign for him is way too expensive, so we have to wait. All right, and we look at that. All right, let's uh, sim up to the next game here and then set our lineup and call it a day. Next game is going to be a double header against, I believe, the Wild Pigs. So we have that to look forward to next episode. It's going to be another long one. Speaking of them, they lose to the Sirlings in 12 innings, 3-1. to one. Blowfish then have a back and forth with the Saw Teeth and manage to hold them off, winning 8-7. to seven. Buzzers win in 13 innings, 3 nothing over the wide loads. Uh, Crocodons win 10 over the Nemesis, 2-1. to one. Herbosaurs bounce back with a win over the Sandcats here. Final score 13-1 to one as they blow them out. Beebles beat the Heaters at a pitcher's duel, 3-1. to one. Moose get a win, 3-0 over the Moonstars. Platypi win in 13-3-2 over the Overdogs. Jacks beat the Beagles, 6-5. And Wyloads crush the Grapplers, 9-3 in the final game of the Sim. We currently have a half-game lead here over the Herbosaurs. We're a 6-3. Uh, both of us looking pretty good to make the playoffs. Uh, so are the Sirloins and Blowfish. Everyone else is at 500 or worse. Uh, Sawteeth, I'm just throwing them out of the playoffs right now. They're 0-8. And the Moose are not looking hot at 3-6 and six with a negative 66 run differential. I'm going to throw them out as well. So those two teams are already out in my book. On the other side, uh, everyone in the Epic Division has a chance. Platypi, though, look pretty solid to make it sitting at 7-2, and two, barring a huge collapse. Crocodons, they're at 2-7. and seven. I'm going to throw them out. They're not going to make it unless they go on a 7-game winning streak. Everyone else is at 500 or better in that division, so they're looking pretty... That looks like the most competitive division this year. Alrighty, next time out is the doubleheader against the Wild Pigs. First game will be our Aces. Uh, Beavis Ortiz for the Wild Pigs, 0-1 with a 6-3-5 ERA and an 0-7-1 whip. And for us, it is Hedwig Lafayette, 1-1 with a 6-7-5 ERA and a 1-5-8 whip. And then the second matchup, uh, we can preview that here in the schedule. That will be uh, rookie Janice Berry for us on the mound. And on the other side, it will be 10th year vet Yolanda Cooper for the Pigs. All right, let us uh, set the lineup here and call it a day for game one. All righty, Correa's going to lead off again. I'm going to put Freeman in here. And Burnett's just going to have to bat. I don't have anyone who can, like, play third base. Oh, I got it. All right, I got it now. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I really like that. Okay. Yeah, that's how we're going to do it. Okay. So the lineup for, next step for the first game of next episode looks like this. Correa on fire leaves off again in right field. Then it is Jennings, the captain in center field. He'll bat second. He's still locked in. Then it is still locked in left fielder Gideon Turnbull. Rookie will bat third. Rookie shortstop Leo Orr still locked in. Bats fourth again. McFreddy will take up his duty at third base in the five slot as he moves to a backup position, allowing Kenzie Rodriguez to play at first base. She'll bat sixth. Uh, then uh, batting seventh back in the lineup will be the fish man, Cole Salmon, at second base. Parker Freeman, the backup catcher, will start for Efford Ho, who is tense and tired. He'll bat eighth. And batting ninth will be D.H. Bad Hop Brown.
as uh, he will DH thanks to McFreddy playing third and Rodriguez moving the first to replace the 10th Burnett. All right, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. A solid win today over the Herbosaurus. Nice, clean 6-1 to one win. Wasn't really in doubt until that last inning there where it got a little shaky, but we got out of the jam. Uh, so another win gives us the division lead. We finished the first half at 6-2, and two, on pace to make the playoffs again for the seventh straight year. That sets us up for the second half, which kicks off with a doubleheader against the Wild Pigs next time out. So be excited for that. Uh, if you made it this deep in the video, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Hopefully it was a little bit enjoyable for you. Leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel. And also, happy 4th of July to all my fellow Americans out there. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed your holiday responsibly and had a great time doing so. Until next time, this is The Nasty One, signing off.